How you doing? Steve Noble, Noble Moto. So we got going on today is we're going to try a battery restore with Epsom salt. I read this online. I have no idea if this is going to work. Hopefully I don't build a bomb. So currently it's on the trail charger. Uh, it's plugged in the trail charger. As you can see right now, we're bouncing between 10 and 14 volts, probably from the trail charger. Whoops. So we will unplug here. Whoop. Unplug trail charger. We are sitting at 6.3, oh wait, 10.2 volts. Kick the switch on. We get on two volts. This battery's pretty much shot. It's been a trickle charger for a few days. It's probably about four or five years old or so. So it's definitely shot. So let's see what happens. All right. I don't know how well this is going to work. I'm going to try to put it all down the funnel and in the hole. We're going to red somewhere. You don't have to drain it out. You can just add it in there. Um, to be said, I'm wearing safety glasses. Another related PPE, just in case I accidentally build a bomb here or something. Hopefully I don't. So, we'll go to the first one here. I have a tablespoon of Epsom salt. Just keep tapping it, I guess, to uh, get it to go down in there. Be acting like it's full. Let's take a small screwdriver here and there we go. So, what we're going to use a small screwdriver there, where we can just kind of keep forcing down. All right. Now supposedly, the the salt in there eats the film that builds up on your lead plates, and once that film of corrosion is gone, they will the electrolytes will do their thing and produce magical electricity again. Um, you just have to turn it over a couple times. I'm gonna rinse the top of this off too. And we'll just shake it up. Well, it's making a little salty noise. Now, we've done absolutely nothing to this. I mean, absolutely nothing. Besides, put the salt in it. So, we're on DC. Let's see what happens. Um, well, it reads about the same voltage as before. So, we're going to put on a trail charger for a few hours. Those cheap old AutoZone battery tenders, and we will see what happens. Stay tuned. All right, here we are. Next day, Just on the battery tender slash trickle charger all night, about 24 hours. DC voltage. And we are sitting at 13.5, 13.4. We'll see what happens if we put a load on it. Okay, battery's back in the bike. 
Um, sitting at 13 volts with it just hooked up. I'm gonna turn the key on. 12 2 is pretty solid, 11 9. Get the choke on. Let's see if it cranks. I was being a little pissy about starting, but um, yeah, it cranks over. It was deader than doornail before. That is impressive. Holy crap. All right, one last little test here. I got this uh, diehard battery charger, just battery analyzing too. Uh, so we're going to just hook this up to the trickle charger. Right there. Eighty-five percent right now. Holy crap. That's amazing.